What should I do? I want to finish the lab on time, but I would have to do everything perfectly. Is there another way out of this? You're late. You only have one hour to complete this lab, and you better do it right. I know what you can do. Just copy someone else's lab. It's the fastest and easiest way through life. Just do it. Do it. No, don't do it. Edwards would be so mad at you. She's done so much for you. Do you really want to do this to her? Now go mask that KCL. You're right. I have to make Edwards happy. But wait, how do I prepare a one molar solution of KCL? Don't worry about that. Just steal the solution over there from that student. He's already completed this lab. Then you can go home and play some ping pong. No, don't do that. Remember, one molar equals one mole of KCL per one liter of solution. Right, the molar mass of KCL equals, um, ah, 74.55 grams per mole. Now I just need to get this many grams and weigh it. Hmm, but there's only a 100 milliliter volumetric flask available. Um, right, I need to multiply the actual mass I need by, with 1 liter by 0.1 to get the mass I need for 100 milliliters. There's still an unknown solution in here. Hmm. Oh, come on. It's probably just DI water anyway. It looks clear enough to me. Use it. No, it might not be DI water. Come on, just take your time and rinse it out. Hmm. All right. All right. So I need 7.455 grams. But that's so precise. Oh no, I'm short by 0.1 grams. This is going to be so nerve-wracking. This doesn't matter. This is only a lab. I want to play some ping pong now. Hurry up. No, you can't do that. Just keep your cool and take your time. That 0.1 gram will no longer make it one molar now, would it? And Edwards would be so sad. <laughs> Pour it faster. Just approximate this. No, remember you have to get the sides of the flask too to get all the solutes in. Careful, you're almost at the calibration line. Almost there, almost there. Alright, you've done it! Yes, I did it! And with one minute left to spare. Fantastic!